Where am I? I woke up in a dark room tied up to a bed. I looked around and saw a black shadow of a beast. I tried to scream but there was no sound. I blacked out. Flashback started in my head. I remember I was at a party with my boyfriend, catching up with some old schoolmates. Then I waked up. I thought all of this was a dream, but in reality, I was really in a stranger's bed. You're home now, my love. Who are you? This is not funny. Untie me now. My love, I can't do that. Why you keep calling me your love? Who the fuck you think you are? I tried to untie myself so many times, but it never worked. Oh lord, am I really gonna die in this damn bed? You know what? Instead of trying to untie myself, maybe I should just find out who is he and what the hell he want with me. What is he going to do to me? While I started crying, I asked him, what the hell you want with me? Why you bring me to a place like this tied up? Do you know that's called kidnapping? If it's money you want, just say so. When I finished asking my question, he didn't answer me right away. He started laughing out of nowhere. He got up from the chair he was sitting with in the corner. He started walking toward me while laughing so calmly. That's when I found out, this man whole body is bigger than any man that be at the gym. How am I going to escape this beast? He was a man with a laugh of a beast. That will scare anyone that looks straight into his eyes. A man with a smile that looked like an angel. A man with curly hair. Even his eyes in the room glowed up his lips. What are you thinking about Candace snap yourself out of it? He started walking toward me with his hands in his pocket. All I could think about was why is this man walking toward me for? When he reached next to the bed he stopped laughing and gave me a smirk.